Hello, my dear Leo Lion friends. This is Jamie, Little Red Tarot. I am here for your November 2019 reading. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising, November 2019. If you're subscribed to the Little Red channel, thank you so much for being part of the Little Red Tarot family. If you're not, hit like, subscribe, and share. If you are, like and share. <laughs> also, this is a timeless reading when you come across this when you're meant to hear it. Tarot is here to help, not hinder. The outcome is never set in stone. If you don't like the outcome, change it. You're the captain of your own ship. You're thrown free will. This is a general reading that may or may not resonate. There are plenty of other YouTubers out there. Feel free to check them out. Take what applies. Leave what doesn't. It's your intuition. You know what it is. Also, even though I'm reading for Leo, I might be reading for the opposite energy. Again, take it where it applies. Whichever video gets the most likes, we'll get a bonus reading. And I know November is almost over. We're coming up on Thanksgiving. Um, so, sorry, I say, um... Um, no. Okay, so, <laughs> sorry. Everything you need to know is down in the description box below. Astro chart for your sun, moon, and rising. The private readings, which I need your sun, moon, and rising for. Also, the tarot cards I use. And I do accept donations. They are greatly appreciated. Appreciated. Everything is down there below. I shuffle off camera. So don't be alarmed. There's not very many shuffles on camera because I soften the spirits. Tell me to stop. I like to open up a little prayer. Lord in heaven, I come to you in the name of Jesus for the Holy Spirit. I want to thank you for this day and thank you for our blessings. I want to thank you for this gift that you give me. I want to thank you for speaking to me and through me. I want to thank my spirits, my personal spirits, and the spirits of those who are listening or are following whatever message needs to get across. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Okay, in my pre-shuffle, when things come to me, I just write them down. So I'm going to read the words and tell you what it means to me, what messages I got as I was reading it. Some are just there. So take it. Or leave it. I got aspirin, blood pressure, watch your blood pressure, anger, watch your temper, blessings, misunderstandings, enough. You're at a 10, I need you at a 4. Strength, patience, last nerve, snap, cash me outside, how about that, ghetto side, mulberry bush, all around the mulberry bush, the monkey chases the weasel, the, run the runaround, end the cycle. Okay, so now let me go back through. So this aspirin, blood pressure, watch your blood pressure, anger, watch your temper. There's definitely somebody who's pissing you off. It could be a teenage child. It could be a partner. It could be a co-worker, a boss, whatever. I mean, you could be pissing yourself off. I mean, you, whatever this is, but you need to, there's somebody out there who needs to watch their blood pressure. They need to take some aspirin. Of course, always check with the doctor before you do anything. But you need to watch your anger because if you have a blood pressure problem anyways and then you get angry, you lose your temper, it's going to make it worse. Watch that, especially with Thanksgiving coming up. Family can piss you off so fast. Maybe it's a brother, somebody you haven't seen in a while. You need to take it as that resonates. teenage kids music is way too loud and I couldn't concentrate okay I'm sorry anyway so aspirin blood pressure anger watch your temper so then we have blessings and misunderstandings so in this I am hearing that there's a misunderstanding which makes you upset but it's really a blessing so you need to watch that make sure you truly understand what is being said or being done before you assume that it's for the negative then we're back to enough. You're at a 10. I need you at a 4. So somebody is really pushing your nerve because we got last nerve. We got snap. It's going to take strength and patience to deal with this person. Because the last thing you want to do is have your ghetto side come out. Cast me outside. How about that? You, you, you're, you're getting there. You're, or they're going to push you there. Or that's normally where they push you. I really feel like this is some sort of Thanksgiving get together for somebody. So you're really going to have to really... Work on your strength, your patience, watching your temper and your blood pressure. Just meditate, whatever. Um, and then we have the mulberry bush, the runaround, and the cycle. So I really feel like this is really for one person maybe or one set of people, whatever. But because the mulberry bush, the, rush, the runaround, so maybe there's somebody in a relationship and they keep giving you the runaround, the runaround, and you're going to say, enough! Enough, just enough. Don't make me turn ghetto on you, okay? 
Don't make me take my earrings off. <laughs> don't make me take off my shoes. Whatever. <laughs> don't, I mean, don't make me get ugly up in here. Y'all gonna make me lose my cool up in here. Up in here. Just, everybody just relax. Okay, no family violence on Thanksgiving. I know. <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to laugh because I know it's a real thing. I know it's real serious. Trust me, I have had my fair share. Siblings can be a pain in the butt. But that's okay. We love them. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and go into the reading. Now I do, I draw cards and messages. And then I do extra messages and clarifications. And then I do love, career, and then one last set of messages. Just to top it off. So, let's go ahead and begin. This is for Leo. Sun, Moon, and Rising. November 2019. What messages do we have for my Leo friends? Sun, Moon, and Rising, November 2019. Now, Leos, y'all been popping up in a lot of people's readings. So, I don't know if someone out there is being an HO. But I'm just saying. Just breaking hearts, running around, being a fool. <laughs> I love my lions. Anyway, so. Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. November 2019. What messages do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising? November 2019. One last shuffle, please, for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. November 2019. What messages do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising? November 2019. Leo, okay, that was fast. Leo, so I'm going to, okay. Do, do, do. See, we got that five of cups. Did one flip over? Let's see. Do, do, do. Did you see anything flip over? No. Okay. So we have the Knight of Swords. The Knight of Swords is about a message coming in quickly. He's running. He's got his... I can't think of the name of that, but so I'm going to call his face mask up, his face shield. <laughs> he's got it up. So he's not running in the battle. He's on a way to deliver a message. So some sort of message is going to come through. And the Five of Cups is about crying over the spilled cups, but not seeing the cups behind you. So that's where that, what was it, blessings and misunderstandings. So, this message, like I said, you need to really clarify this message. So, this message comes through, you hear one thing, but it's really another. It's really a blessing. But you have a misunderstanding of what this message is. A message comes through, you think it's saying this, but in reality it's giving you this. Because then there's the Page of Pentacles. It's here. This is what I have to offer you. And this is a blessing. So you need to be very careful. You need to understand what is being said before you let your little heart be broken. Be disappointed. These cups got kicked over. But really, it's a blessing. So you misunderstand what's being said. It's not like, oh, it's a blessing in the skies. No. No. What I'm telling you is something, a message comes through to you. You hear it as these cups being kicked over. But that's a misunderstanding on your part. Because really... There's these two cups right here. It's, they're trying. No, I'm trying to hand you these cups. Let, let me hand you this blessing. Don't cry over this because it's that, the cups didn't get kicked over. There are no cups there. You misunderstood. I don't know why I can't say that enough. You misunderstood. There, there's no cups kicked over. That's what I'm hearing. Stop it. Turn around. You misunderstood this message. This is a gift trying to be given to you. I hear that very adamantly. I mean, I got that in the pre-reading, too. Okay? All right. Leo, summon him. Okay. Summon him. Okay. Goodness. See? Again, we have the Six of Cups. This is nostalgia. This is childhood. This is, again, here's the blessings. They overflow. The cups are growing. Flowers, just beauty. The passing from one generation or, you know, an older sibling to a younger sibling, whatever this is. She's handing out the blessings. There's blessings being handed out. Whoop! But here you are. All blindfolded. And you're not bound. You can go like, mm, 
and let go. I mean, just break all that. I mean, it, it looks like toilet paper to me. I mean, it, it, like, you know, when your siblings, you know, you play around, they wrap you up in toilet paper, you know, because you're playing, like, pin to, like, tie you to the railroad tracks or something that could be very specific to somebody. Whoever that is, maybe y'all did that. Tied to, like, a doll or pretend to tie yourselves. Whatever. But this looks like toilet paper to me. Just, you can just rip it off. And you have all these swords that you're, like, crying about. It, it just reiterates this one right here. It's saying, look at these blessings. Take off your damn blindfold and look at these cups. You misunderstood what this message was. You got a message and you think it's this. Look, you're all crying and bent out of shape over the cups that did not spill. Because here they are. You misunderstood a message. Or you're going you're gonna get a message and you're gonna potentially misunderstand it. Don't it is a blessing. I don't know who that is for, but I'm getting a headache screaming at you. It's a blessing! There are no freaking cups spilled. <laughs> I don't know who that is for, Leo. Alright. Let's get some clarification and extra messages for Leo Sun so Rising. November 2019. I have some messages and clarification, please, for Leo. Sun, Moon, and Rising. November 2019. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you for being here. Thank you for speaking through me and to me. Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Extra message clarification. November 2019. One more shuffle, please. For my Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Extra messages and clarification. November 2019. November 2019, after messages, okay, clarifications, okay. Do -do -do. See, fin financial and material changes. Destiny, this is destined. This financial ma material change is dest. Sorry, you can't quite see that. I'm like over here, like, you want to see that? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> financial and mater material changes. This message here is going to bring you financial and material changes. It is your destiny. This is a gift from the universe. But you're going to see it as these cups. But it's not. It's a gift. It's a blessing. So, understand that this message is not spilled cups. It's not. I just keep getting so frustrated. Y'all have this negative mindset. Oh, that couldn't happen to me. All right, Eeyore. What the hell? Stop seeing the negative. There is no negative in this. It's positive. Ugh. Financial material changes. It's your destiny. I don't know why. Somebody's being very stubborn about seeing this. Okay. Accelerated motion. Oh, okay. See? Yeah, see? Accelerated motion. Remember how I said Knight of Swords is about a message coming in very quickly. Everything is moving forward very fast. This message is going to come in. It's going to give you financial material changes. It's your destiny. Everything suddenly starts moving forward very quickly. It's a shooting star, make a wish, let's do this thing. But here you are, stuck in your damn head with this mental conflict. Because all you see is the cup that fucking got spilled. Forgive my language. Lord, I just feel this frustration. <laughs> I don't know who that is. I mean, there is a somebody, some spirit is hanging around, and they are very, very frustrated with you. They love you so much, and they're like, could you just get out of this head? There are no cups. This is a blessing. It's a material and financial material changes. It's destiny. Things accelerate quickly when you accept that it's a blessing and not any cups. Like I said, it's not like, oh, this is a blessing in disguise. There is no disguise. It is just a blessing. Ha! Ah! <laughs> Whoo! Okay, breathing. Sorry, I love you guys so much. Oh, that's just ah. Okay, this is love, and then I'm gonna do career, and then one final message. So, for Leo Sun and Rising love situations, November 2019. Ooh, Leo's Leo Sun and Rising love situations, November 2019. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you for being here. Thank you for speaking to me and through me. Leo's love sir. Blah, blah, blah. Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Love Situations, number 2019. One more shuffle.
Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising, Love Situations, November 2019. What messages do we have? Okay, there's one. Oh, there's two. We have success and growth. And reach out. Okay, so there's... Maybe you feel like that your partner has... There's so much success and growth that your partner maybe has outgrown you. You're seeing, you're seeing these damn cups. Oh, well, look how successful they are. Look how much they've grown. I'm really still the same person I used to be. And you're afraid that they're going to leave you. Nah, this is a blessing. I'm going to say it again. You need to reach out to them. You need to speak to them. You need to speak to your partner, to your family member, whatever this is. But so, something is growing and there's lots of success and you are afraid that they have outgrown you. Stop seeing the negative. That's not the case. This is a blessing for you too. This is your partner. They chose you. This is success and growth together. Reach out. Stop being in this friggin' Eight of Swords thing. Stop it. Just stop it. Alright. Well, Leo. Summon and Rising. Low Situations. November 2019. What messages do we have? For Leo. Summon and Rising. Oh, Lord. Okay. See, you are feeling alone. This is in your own head. You are so afraid that they have there's so much success and so much growth that they've left you. You're feeling alone when there's no reason to feel alone. This is a blessing. They chose you. They want you as their partner. They are when he succeeds or she succeeds, you succeed. Stop this. Stop this. Lord. You have to master your own heart. You can control your emotions. You're allowed to feel what you feel. But then you need to master it and say, stop. This is why I, this is my this is my own head. This is my mental conflict. There is no reason for me to feel this way except for my insecurities. You need to master that. You need to meditate. Stop seeing negativity. Just stop it. There is nothing negative going on here. Lord. Alright, Leo, someone in rising career situations. November 2019. Thank you, Spirit. Thanks for being here. Thanks for speaking to me and for me. What messages do we have for Leo? Someone in rising career situations. November 2019. Leo, Leo, Leo. Someone in rising career 2019. <laughs> That song, I want to hear, uh, Roar, I can't think of it, I can't get the tune, but y'all know the song. You're gonna hear me roar. Right on, Leo, roar, babies. Just do it. Stop it. Roar. Get the, mm, out of this energy. Just stop it. Your own mental conflict. You need to master that crap. Let go. See? That just popped out of my shuffle. Let go. Walk away from the situation in order to resolve it. And leave that one right there, my Leo friends. Let this negative energy go. Stop seeing the negative. Alright, Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Career situation, November 2019. Maybe you feel like, okay, since this is a career, we got to let go. I mean, the let go, that's just overall, I'm telling you. Everybody just needs to let go. But, career situation, so maybe you need to let go. And, and you know that you need to walk away from this job or this partner or whatever for your business to grow. But you see that if you walk away, you, you're just kicking cups over. You can't see that when you turn and walk away you're not kicking cups over you're bringing more cups to you there's two cups behind you let go of this situation stop holding on to this devil you know just stop it stop it okay leo sun moon and rising y'all give me a headache i don't know who this is yelling but they are yelling at somebody somebody is just this is might just be for somebody in particular i don't know let me know in the comments below all right, Leo, summon and rising career situations. November 2019. What messages do we have? 
one more shuffle for Leo Summon and Rising Career Situation, November 2019. I need an aspirin. Thank you, Leo. Maybe that was like a warning for me to take an aspirin before I started reading for y'all. <laughs> Love you. Okay. Leo Summon and Rising Career. We're going to take that one. Career Situation, November 2019. What do we got? Options. See, consider the character. Why can't I speak today? See, that's my misunderstanding since when y'all weren't speaking up. Wait, consider the career possibilities that are open to you. You need to let go because there are plenty of options. Turn around. There are no cups filled away. Isn't that what I said? Leo, so I'm in a rising career situation. November 2019. Time to decide. Make a decision based on your own based on your heart's true desires. Walk away from this, let it, let it go, let it go. This bullshit doesn't bother me anyways. Watch your blood pressure. Don't let it piss you off. Just let it go. You've got plenty of other options. You know it's time to decide. Stop fearing the cups and see that are spilled and see the cups that are really there because these spilled cups are imaginary. I'm going to say it again. They're not really there. Leo, Summon and Rising. See, and then we have the heart's desire. Lord, I can't make this crap up. Okay. Heart's desire. The angels are supporting, guiding, and protecting you as your dream becomes a reality. Stop seeing spilled cups. There are no spilled cups. Turn around. Let this go. You've got options. It's time to decide. Follow your heart. Make a decision based on your heart's true desire. Heart's desire. Ah! And for somebody that heart desire is writing. You heal, inspire, teach, and entertain with the words you write. Somebody needs to write. Maybe you need to write in a journal for your own self to figure out what these options and heart desires are. For others, you need to actually sit down. You have a book you've been wanting to write. You have short stories. You have a children's book, teen book, adult book, naughty book, whatever. <laughs> whatever it is. That is your heart's desire and you already know it. So stop it. There are no negativities. There are no cups. There's no cups that are going to get knocked over because you follow your heart's desire for this. Go for it. Please stop putting it off. Please. There are two cups right behind you. These other cups are imaginary, my friends. All right. One last final message for Leo, Summon, and Rising, November 2019. One message. Somebody, I heard script, play. Someone needs to write a play. Did I get musical in this one? Or is that with the other group? I think that might have been uh, Cancer that got musical. Let me see. What did I get? I can't find you. Where are you, Leo? Come back. Okay, there you are. No, it wasn't you. It was um, Cancer that got, that got musical. So maybe you have Cancer in your sign, something arising or something like that, or you're dealing with a Cancer. A musical Cancer. I don't know. I, I just heard that. Whatever that means, y'all. There's a Cancer who's very musical. Very artistic, creative, writing. There's some sort of play or script you want to write. And you're afraid that if you ask this person, you're going to, I don't know, maybe tip the cups over or something. I don't know. Stop it. There are no cups. There are no negative cups. There are no spilled cups. Woo All right. Extra messages and clarifications. One last time. One final message for Leo, Summon, and Rising. November 2019. Okay. One more shuffle, please, for Leo, Summon, and Rising. One last message and clarifications, please. November 2019, Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. One last message for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. November 2019. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you for being here. Thank you for speaking to me and through me. I'm not going to take those. Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. I'm going to take that one. What message do we have? See the hero font? That is about going inside yourself. That is about writing. See the knowledge. You have all this knowledge you want to pass down to the next generation. You want to share this. Stop holding it inside. Stop being selfish. Share it. And the hero plant is Taurus. So again, could be in your sun, moon, rising. Could be in your chart. Could be whoever you're dealing with. Doesn't may not mean anything at all. It could be that you need to stop being so bullheaded and just do it. Follow your heart's desire. Let go. Options. Sign to the side. Heart's desire. Writing. Come on. Just do it. So that's what I'm getting from that. All right. Let's see. X message clarifications for Leo, sun, moon, and rising. One last message, November 2019. See, Ace of Cups. What I say? Heart's desire. The angels are supporting, guiding, and protecting you as your dreams become a reality. Ace of Cups. I mean, this is just overflowing. And this is all these rooms. It's like knowledge, 
coming out. You're sharing this knowledge. This is for somebody. This last message is forever this is for. It's time to share this knowledge. It's time to write it down. I like how this, what is this? Ogre or whatever. Ogre, you know, is like your mental conflict and, and all that. You've turned into stone and you've buried him and you've placed your ace of cups on top of him. You're using him. Look how he's holding it up for you. You're like, no, nope, enough. What was that that I said? Enough. Let me just find you. I don't know why. I just don't leave it open. <laughs> yes, I said enough. You're, you're at a 10. I need you to four. Your last nerve. Snap. You just said enough. You said enough of this and you just, you sat on it. You took care of this mental conflict and you set it down. You let, you placed your ace of cups on top of this mental conflict, top of this negativity. You said enough. And it's time to pass this knowledge on. You need to write that down, whoever that's for. All right, Leo Summon and Rising November 2019. One last message, please, for Leo. Queen of Cups. It's about manifesting that cup. It's about getting into your own intuition. This is like the the scene glass. You, she's she's hopping into her own intuition. She is finding her own inner peace. Nobody else controls your temper, how you feel, how you react. You are the master of that. You need to calm down. You need to know that there are many this is a blessing. Many blessings. You need to stop. Control that. Master that mental conflict. Breathe. Stop seeing the worst. Stop being the ring left on the table person. Okay? See the glass is full. Not half full. Full. It's full. I don't want a half full cup. I want a full cup. And that's what I'm going to manifest. Alright? Alright, I'm going to draw a couple more and see what we get. See the fool. The fool is, he's just oblivious. I mean, he's happy. I'm walking on sunshine. Yeah. And don't feel good. When you get out of that mental conflict, when you release that, when you see that there's blessings and that you can manifest a cup, a full cup, those blessings come to you because it's your destiny. Remember? Remember? It's your destiny. So smoke up. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Alright? It's okay to walk on sunshine. It's okay to accept blessings. Don't always wait for that other shoe to drop. Just do it. I wonder if he nibbles on that mushroom if he'll get taller. <laughs> Sorry. I love you guys. Like, subscribe, and share. Thank you for being part of the Little Red Tarot family. Whichever video gets the uh, most likes, we'll get a bonus reading. Happy Thanksgiving. I love you so much.